we kayaked from that time. <laughs> Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon, and welcome to a new episode. So today, we are in New York City. I know it's hard to believe, but look at that. You've got Manhattan right here behind us. So we are off. Uh, we are basically going south, uh, almost on the ocean side of New York, uh, basically. It's uh, after Staten Island. And so we've got brown wind right here with the awesome hat. We've got Trina to the steering the boat right now. And we've got Matthew right here that was hiding inside us. The goal of today is simply to help Brownwind take her boat down there. There is a happy, what do you call the happy gratitude festival thing. She's gonna go to, we won't be able to stay there, but we're sailing with her. And I really want to share with you those views because it's incredible. So a lot of people don't know too much about sailing around New York, but it's actually a great place to start. We just got honked by the giant <laughs> barge that you see because it was basically coming straight at us. We had to tack twice and now we're back on track. And I'm gonna take this opportunity to give you a little tour of the boat. This is, this is basically the living room. You've got a bedroom area right here. Here you've got the kitchen, desk, fridge over there, some survival stuff. The bathroom is over here. <laughs> right, Bronwyn? Right. Am I correct? Correct. Sailing is all about patience. I would call it slow living because just sail slow and you're just cruising. If you're racing, it's different, but here we're just cruising. Guys, we've been stranded for days on this boat now. <laughs> <laughs> but we still have Facebook! Or yeah! Navionics oh, no. chart plotting! So now we're trying to get to a point. The wind like kind of dropped. It's kind of super slow right now. You could use that. But that's cheating. So we're getting closer, but we might get hit by the storm that's coming behind us. All right, quick update. So after being stranded on the sandbank, we anchored somewhere in the middle of nowhere. Actually, we're not that far from the nowhere. There is a shore here, but we're gonna try to get closer. We have no way to get on shore except an inflatable kayak. We'll see how that works out. And a hand it's, pump. <laughs> it's really, yeah, yeah. We're setting up kayaks to escape this boat. <laughs> I have like nothing waterproof for my cameras or anything. Is it okay for you, Trina? Um, eh, we'll see. I mean, it, it's we'll just, the, the shore is just there. So it shore is not bad. too far yeah. and it's raining a little bit, but not too much. So yeah, yeah. it's been a crazy adventure so far. There is a festival that's going to be on that yeah. beach. We uh, just need to catch our bus, which leaves in a little over an hour. Yeah. And so we don't really know exactly where. We'll find it, we'll find it. Beautiful sunset. All right, we have to get in here, guys. We have to get in here. Ready to leave the boat? I am in the heat. <laughs> Trina's going in. That's a lot more stable than I thought it was going to be. Trina, you ready? Yeah, which way is the pedal? It's just like this. migration tickets are about five hundred dollars a person so for a couple that's about one thousand dollars but you know what we found the best cost savings what's We're that safe. here we know <laughs> we kayaked from this end <laughs> yeah crazy just takes that's been hanging in the background somewhere oh yeah we can see it you can you can maybe not hear it but there you can see the sunset which is sick and look Here's the festival!
been a bit crazy, but... And everyone made it on shore. Matthew was like swimming like a crazy man. How was the swim, Matthew? Long. It was no. good. <laughs> Water's warm. Going back to New York home. City. I can't believe I have gonna to take the bus. Crazy. And Brownwin and Matthew are you gonna stay here and just enjoy the festival, right? Yep. While watching their boat out there in the horizon. <laughs> and look at that crazy sunset. It's so beautiful, guys. Oh wow. You see? It's wow. We're back guys. Crazy day, crazy day. Pretty intense day, I would say. It was absolutely amazing. I hope you have enjoyed those like different views. We finally got the bus. We made it back to New York City. Uh, it took a good amount of time, maybe like an hour and a half to get back, but it's not so bad. The whole adventure wasn't really planned in the sense that we were just sailing down with a friend to, uh, and they were going to that festival, what we didn't know is that it would end up like in kind of an adventure with the weather going crazy, like being in the storm, we're in like a thunderstorm, there were like lightning all around, I couldn't even take the camera out to film anything. And, and then like that, that section where we had to like actually kayak to shore and the boat was really far, it was pretty intense, uh, knowing also that we actually um, touched the ground two times while sailing because it was full of sandbanks there and so we kind of got stuck twice on the sandbank. Great adventure, awesome day. As I always say guys when you're like going for a trip or anything and you don't really have expectations that is when you can enjoy it the most because you're not expecting anything you're just going with the flow and you're just enjoying it for what it is. Now we're pretty dirty we're gonna go take a shower and we're gonna see you tomorrow for new adventures and remember guys if you like that video leave it a big, big thumbs up make sure you subscribe to this channel if you haven't that would be crazy and remember make the most of your time on this planet you never know when it ends see you tomorrow bye bye